guys welcome to you in this video we are going to see how to download and install samsung m2876 nd printer driver in a windows 11 pc or laptop it is a very easy and simple process so let's go first go to the any web browser i am going to the google chrome you can go to the any web browser and here type samsung m2876 nd driver hit enter key on our keyboard and the first link first link is from the hp.com samsung and hp are now combined samsung printers and hp printers are now combined that's why our drivers are on the hp side don't worry open the hp side first link and here we find our drivers it's detect your operating system windows 10 and there is no problem with the windows 10 drivers with the windows 11 drivers are supported on the windows 11 operating system also if you want to change then go to there and change anywhere that you want but in my case i'm not changing any os okay here we find many option two options are important you can use two options universal printer driver universal printer drivers it is supported all samsung printers or go to the here here we find driver product installation software click at here here we find basic drivers, extant basic drivers. And here we find three drivers. First is the printer driver. Second is the scanner driver. And third is the LAN drivers or network drivers for installing printer. We install printer driver and scanner drivers. I click on the first drivers, printer driver, click at download. It's redirect to the another page and in few seconds our download is started here we find our download is started and in few seconds our download is completed now our download is completed go to the here here we find show in a folder go to the show in folder minimize this and drag this file to desktop now close it now go to the our web browser again go to the our browser and go to the back go to the back to our browser once again, we find here driver product installation software, expand, expand basic drivers. Here we find scan driver, click on the scan driver. Now our scan uh, file is, uh, our web browser is redirected to another page and our download is started and it takes few seconds or few minutes. It's a very small file. Click at here, show in a folder and drag it to desktop. Now close it. Here we find two files. Here is the our printer file and here is the our scanner file. We go to the our first our printer file. This is our basically printer file. Double click on our printer file. Click on the yes. Click on the next. Accept the terms and conditions. Read the terms and conditions and accept the terms and conditions and click on the next. Here we find three options. If your printer is new, if you attach your printer newly, then go to the with the this new printer. If your printer is already attached and install drivers and if any problem then go with the second option existing printer and if you not connect your printer then go with the no printer connected. I am not connect my printer to the my PC at I am install it and after that I attach my printer. I click on the no printer connection and click on the next. Here we find my printer drivers click on the next. Now it is installing our printer. It takes few minutes or few seconds depending on the speed of your PC. So be a patient and wait for a few minutes. Now our printer is installed. Click on the finish. Now the second option is scanner. Scanner is also important. Go to the scanner drivers. Double click on scanner drivers. Click on the yes. Click on the next. Accept the terms and condition. Read the terms and condition and click on the next. Here we find also three option new printer, existing printer or no printer connection. I am going with the no printer connection. I click on the next. Click on the next. Now our scanner is installing. It takes few minutes or few seconds. Be a, be a patient. Now check our printer is properly installed or not. Go to the start. Type control panel. Click on the control panel. Go to the devices and printers. Here we find printer and scanner. Click at here. And here we find our Samsung printer is installed on our PC or laptop. So guys, this is the simplest way to install this printer on Windows 11 PC or laptop. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thank you guys.